And welcome. I'm delighted to be able to say perfect playing conditions for this game here at the Estadio Jose Soria. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And everyone here on Tenterhooks, you'd have to say with good reason. It's Real Valladolid, and they take on Lille. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Oh, he saved it well. And there's the delivery. Oh, cleared off the line. Alert defending. Plenty of support here. Well, strong play here. And a chance for them to nudge in front. Well, what a stop that was. André. Remy Cabela. That's useful play. Bamba. André. Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. Corner kick played in. Well, not the best clearance. Foiling his opponent completely. Great pressure to win the ball back. Gomes. Andre Gomes. No, high quality defending. Serhi Guardiola. Now with Kennedy. Escudero. No possibilities inside the box. And a good take under duress there. He's going forward well here. Can they nudge in front? And a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, Lille certainly haven't dominated the ball so far, but when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. It is a decent-looking attack here. Oh, could be! And what a magical save it was! Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, the story of the first half has been written. So, back underway here, into the second half. Still be able to do a bit of damage. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Well, that save just about keeps them in this. But they have to pose more of a threat at the other end. Well, as spectacular as the save was, it can't be just about their stellar keeper. They know that. Oh, left his man behind here. Tremendously strong in the tackle. And the cross not quite accurate enough. Moving forward effectively. Oh. 
He takes aim. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power. The keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Roque Mesa and he read it well intercepting it and they continue to advance and a lot of options here and oh it's in we cannot declare this contest over they still believe well as you can see he doesn't mess about here does he he's strong well balanced and skillful that's a top class finish well as they kick off again 2-1 the current state of affairs Andre Cabela. It's with Ismaili. Very quick thinking there. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Well, just listen to the atmosphere in here. The fans doing every bit to try and spur their team on for this equaliser. Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. He's protecting it effectively. Plata. Can he take advantage? He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Now, who can he play it to? Can he finish them off? He's done it! What a climax to this game! Well, there it is. Quite clearly, it takes a deflection, and that's enough to beat the keeper. Not much he could do there. The action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Kennedy. Really good high press. And there it is, the full-time whistle here, and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield, and they created chances as well. It was a